Painter Zhao Wuqi was born in 1921 in Beijing, but moved to France in 1948. Now in his 90s, he no longer paints, but during his working life, he has already created a massive legacy of abstract work, much of which seems to reflect the process of creation itself. Currently showing in Hong Kong is Beyond, a selection of his watercolor works. China for Zhao Wuji was the soil, so he took it with himself and he went to Europe and there he found the seeds and then he made them grow. And so you cannot separate Zhao Wuji from his Chinese nature, origin, many characteristics you know, of Chinese cultures are in him and you cannot separate him from his fascination for Monet, Cezanne uh, or Matisse. And so, uh, uh, basically, you know, he's a mix of all that. So he's beyond any uh, 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 attempt of appropriation. Zawuji started in 1950, when he came to Europe, he started to paint watercolors from nature. And uh, even if nature was just a trigger, it was not a re representation of nature. Then he became a studio painter, painting from studio to studio and creating really in his head uh, uh, these great compositions we know. And uh, uh, at the end of his life, he comes back to, to, to the inspiration from nature. represent a sort of a fulfillment, final fulfillment of what 75 years of painting can bring you to do. And they are very immediate, very spontaneous, sometimes in a pretty large format. I mean, in terms of watercolor, they are pretty large. Very spontaneous uh, expression of his feelings in front of a landscape or uh, flowers or, or any kind of uh, vision he can have. When he paints flowers or from flowers, he doesn't represent the flower. He gives the feeling of a flower, which is more important, more interesting, because he doesn't tell you everything. He leaves you free to go and imagine by yourself. 